Hello everybody. Hi, I'm Jewel and welcome to my channel. Today's topic is the National Kidney Foundation statement on CMS, which is the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services final rule on protected drug class. May 16th, 2019, the Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services, which is CMS, issued a final rule modernizing Part D and Medicare Advantage to lower drug prices and reduce out-of-pocket expenses. The National Kidney Foundation thanks the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services, which is HHS, and specifically CMS, for its decision to not finalize changes to its protected class policy that would have made it more challenging for some transplant recipients to access immunosuppressive drugs that they need to prevent organ rejection when they are covered under Medicare Part D. As initially pro proposed by CMS, the policies would have created broad exceptions to requirements that all immunosuppressives drugs be covered by Part D formularities. Since 2008, this requirement has ensured the safety of transplant recipients, nearly every one of whom depends on a tailored combination of immunosuppressant medications that must be taken every day to prevent organ rejection. By maintaining its protected class coverage policy for immunosuppressives prescribed under Part D, CMS is putting patient safety to its forefront. We also appreciate that CMS will implement a com complaints tracking module monitoring project in 2020 to monitor access to protected class Part D drugs and improvements in electronic prescribing through the use of real, excuse, excuse me, a future real time benefits tool. These addition steps, additional steps recognize the challenges that patients have accessing their medication, even under existing policies. We are all hopeful these new tools will help provide additional information to CMS to improve access and reduce burdens on healthcare professionals who work tirelessly on behalf of patients to ensure they can access medications they need to preserve their transplanted organs. The National Kidney Foundation thanks the hundreds of patients, families, and healthcare professionals who contacted CMS, shared their personal experiences, and advocated to maintain the protected class policy for immunosuppressant drugs. We applaud CMS for listening to these advocates and preserving the patient safety protections inherent in the protected class coverage policy. National Kidney Foundation is a long-standing champion for the comprehensive immunosuppressive coverage needed to maintain the health of transplant recipients. With today's announcement, the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services continues to show commitment to advancing policies that improve the lives of kidney patients. Guys, this is a uh, very big deal. This is uh, very important to me because I am a um, transplant recipient and even myself have had situations where I've had um, problems accessing my own immunosuppressant drugs. If not for the um, fantastic healthcare team that I have, um, they would have, um, it would have been a little impossible, but they have always um, been there for me to make sure that I've, I've had everything I need and um, but this shouldn't be um, this shouldn't be this way you know we should be able to access immunosuppressant drugs when we need them without going through the rigmarole of insurance companies um, um, making um, changes to make it harder for us to access our drugs so I thank CMS for listening to all the recipients of transplants and what they have to go through to um, receive the drugs that they need. And of course, I always thank the National Kidney Foundation for working on all kidney patients' behalf. 
because this is um, this is a really big deal. So guys, this was the National Kidney um, Foundation statement on CMS final rule on protected drug class. And guys, as you see and as you know, there are so many people working in the background for us. So if you like this video and found it useful, please like, share, and subscribe. And know that we are not alone in this journey. And so many people wish us well and are working tirelessly for all of us for our better health. So guys, the only thing that we have to do in this process is be compliant with our doctors, stay positive, always, always stay hopeful, and just take care of ourselves, guys. So if you um, like this video, like I said, please like, share, and subscribe. And as always, take care of yourselves, and I will see you on the next video. Bye. <laughs>